Thank you for joining us. I'm Juliana Valencia. Tense moments outside and inside the Hayburn building in downtown Louisville. Occupy ICE protesters are back, making their stand against the government agency. Several people are blocking the elevators in the building leading up to immigration offices. Our Heather Fountaine joins us live. And Heather, what's been happening? Well, Juliana, at this point, I'm told that all the protesters have been taken out of the building. In fact, literally just minutes ago, we saw a prisoner transportation vehicle leave the back of the Hayburn building. And as it was pulling onto 4th Street, we were hearing people yell, abolish ICE, abolish ICE. Now, I do not have this confirmed by police, but I do have a source telling me that at least nine people have been arrested at this point. I can also tell you we saw police officers taking out what looked like these round control contraptions. These are what we believe um, the protesters were using to kind of link themselves together to block the elevators. Again, these Occupy protesters, Occupy ICE protesters had been out here since about seven o'clock this morning. It is a private building, so we as reporters were not allowed inside, but we did talk to several people who could kind of describe for us what was happening in there. We were told that protesters were blocking the elevators, sort of chaining themselves together with those lock boxes that we saw police officers taking out just a little bit ago. Now, the reason that they chose the Hayburn building is because there is an immigration court upstairs that happens inside. So by blocking these elevators, these protesters were essentially trying to stop that from happening. At this point, we've been told that court has been delayed, but we don't know if it will reconvene now that we've seen that prisoner transportation vehicle leave. In fact, we have seen quite a few families actually who were supposed to go to court this morning. They were just waiting outside for hours while all of this was going on inside. We're told this building also has a doctor's office, maybe even a dentist's office inside. So people with appointments have really just been told to wait. They block the elevator. You can't get up to the floors of where you work at or whatever. So you basically got to use a free elevator to get up there. You know, other than that, I don't know what they're going to do. What the, are they doing? Are they standing together? They stand they together, arms stretched out protesting. We are doing this to free our people to abolish ICE and of course uh, today is the one month uh, deadline for Trump to reunite the families uh, with the children. Uh, this is part of a solidarity action across all you know abolish ICE movement throughout the country. Now, at one point, we had seen at least 30 LMPD officers here. Most of them were, of course, inside. We also saw some ICE officers and some Homeland Security. Again, we just saw that prisoner transportation vehicle take off. We don't know how many people, if any, were inside, but I do have a source telling me that at least nine people have been arrested. We do expect some more information to come out with the police department later this afternoon. You can expect more updates starting at 4 o'clock on WHAS 11. For now, reporting Live. I'm Heather Fountaine, WHIS 11 News.